Here again to the weak and the beggarly element. All right, where unto you ye desire again to be to be in bondage? How? Why would you want to go back and be that under these people? Could that happen during the time um, when Moses brought us out? When Moses brought us out, the people were like, oh, why we can't go back to Egypt? Why would you want to go back? The Lord said, woe to them that turn back to Egypt. Okay? I just, that verse is just sticking. I, I'd seen it, but I wasn't sure what that was it. Okay? Yeah, this verse, oh, man, this chapter, this verse, oh, wow. Hold on. Wow. Sheesh. Just got mad verses. Okay, we're gonna um that's right. So we gotta we got we got this is a sure thing. Alright? This is a sure thing. <laughs> Alright, this is a sure thing. I mean, I, I didn't I never you know, I look around the world, you know, not the whole world, but, you know, I, we, actually, I do see the whole world, and we see everything on YouTube. The Lord has given us a, a, a vessel, a, a, um, a vehicle uh, to be able to see everything on the whole planet. We don't have to be there. We could be home watching everything going on in another country or another continent. All right? <clears throat> All right, let's read this verse again. We're going to read that next verse. I think I had another verse. Because we, we here, baby. This is a sure thing. All right, this, I mean, Jeremiah chapter 24, yeah, Jeremiah chapter 24, verse 5, does say the Lord, Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh, Shah, that the, the power of the God of Israel, like those good figs, so will I acknowledge them that are carried away of Judah, whom I have sent out of this place, into the land, into, out of this place, into another land, out of this place into the land of the Chaldeans for their good. He's going to acknowledge us for their, our good. He's doing that now. This thing we're doing is a good thing. <clears throat> for, verse 6, For I will set my eyes upon them for good. Look. And I will bring them again to this land. He's going to bring us back. They, he didn't say this at this place. Now he's saying the land. So he's bringing people back to a land, okay? And I will build them and not pull them down. I will plant them and not pluck them up. Okay, the Lord said he's going to take a holy goddess. Right there, he said he got our back. Okay? And he's doing that now. He's building us up, okay? He's building us up. All right, hold on. I got another verse. Oh man, I'm telling you, this is spiritual. Look at this one. It says right here. Let's see. Let's see. Hold on. Let me read this real fast before I bring it out. Hold on. Woo! Look what you have. Look, oh man, hold on. Look what you have about you now. Look what they say. They love us, man. They love us. We what we doing? He love us for this. He loves us for this. Oh, okay. Oh, let's go up a verse. Jeremiah, I'm reading all this. I'm getting all this out. What are you talking about? Jeremiah chapter 32, verse 41. Verse 40. And I will make an everlasting covenant with them that I will not turn away. He's not going to turn this away from, after this one. We good. This is forever. An everlasting covenant. I, let me read that again. Jeremiah chapter 32, verse 40, verse 40. I will make an everlasting covenant with them that I will not turn away from them to do them good, but I will put my fear in their hearts. He's going to make a, 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 a stony heart into fleshy, that they should not depart from me. Yea, I will rejoice over them to do them good, and I will plant them, I will plant them, in this land, assuredly, with my whole heart and with my whole soul. What are you talking about? Yeah, this is a sure, this is a sure thing. 
This is a sure thing. This is a sure thing. This is sure right now. This this is for all the marbles. This is what this is why this is what we went through. This is why they, they fell out. This is why we still in it. This is why we still around each other. This is why we still brothers. This is why this is happening. This is a sure thing. If you didn't have if you didn't have hope in anything, have hope in something you can't see. Because that's a sure thing. Because what you see, it can't be what you're gonna get. Because somebody gotta be in subjection. And somebody got to be on top. And right now we are on the, we are in subjection. We are not on top. Because if we was, these mon- nobody would be talking this shit to us. You know? It's a lot here. I'm just looking for a couple more verses. See what else I'm gonna bring out. That's delicious. This is delicious, man. I ain't never tasted something like this in my life. I be, I, you know, you know, I, I, you know, I, you know, I get to see the brothers, you know, through the camp, you know, nine, ten times. It, it, it be, a, it be enough out of a month. But you know, those days when I'm not there, or I, I can't make, it, I gotta be at work. I try my best to do my, do what I gotta do to, to, to feed the ministry. To keep the to keep the hope in the ministry. What a sure thing. This is a sure thing. I would I get that verse out. That was verse. I was dying. Now let me go back to that for a second. Let's go back and read that verse. Cause the, this is this is spiritual. It was gonna be about something else, but now it seemed like it's about um um. That was um. Dang, what was that? That was. Nothing else. Oh, okay, sorry. Let me see if I can just hear. Yep, Second Timothy's. Second. Let's see what. Let's see what's in here. Let's see what's in here. Hold on. Look. Oh, we went into that word. We went to short. We went to nevertheless. We went into um, um. Oh, what was the other word? Jesus. <laughs> um. Salak. I forgot what we went into. Just do the spirit. All right, so like, let's go into this real fast. I would, I just want to see what's going, what's going on in here real fast, real, real quick. All right, sure. S- standing. All right, hold on. Let's see what's in here real fast. Oh, okay. Hold on. <laughs> All right, surely the word. This, this, this whole thing is based around the word sure. I I saw it's like the spirit because I, I was I had this something else in my mind but this is this is a sure thing baby it's a sure thing all right Psalms chapter twelve chapter one twelve verse six surely he shall not be moved forever the righteous shall be in an everlasting remembrance the Lord remember he uh, it's an everlasting it's no the Lord said you know what. I'm gonna beat your ass. I'm gonna put you down. I told you, I gave you all the things through Moses, through all of my prophets, and now I'm gonna beat, I'm gonna put the beats on. Oh, that, oh man, I think I just seen that verse. I'm gonna go back again. Um, I just seen that. Now that verse is coming to come out now. Um, so this is spiritual because this it, it's the um. Oh wait, hold on, Salaki. So he gonna run down, and now he said, he said, but I'm not. You're not. It's not for forever. Not, I'm not gonna beat you forever, but you are gonna remember me. All right. All right. Psalm chapter one twelve verse six. Surely he shall not be moved forever. He's not gonna move. No, yeah, he's not gonna. He's not. It's, hold on a second. Hold on. Oh wow. Okay, it's locking. Surely he will not be moved forever. Right, the righteous shall be in an everlasting. Remember, he's gonna remember us. All right, he's gonna bring us. He's gonna bring us back out of this bull crap. Okay, he, that's what he's doing right now. It's happening. It's a sure thing, baby. It's a sure thing. I seen a verse. I I, I want to fucking find that verse. Nevertheless, I got that. Nevertheless, all right. I just seen it. Right, here we go. Right here. Here we go. Right here. This look. It's like I said. He he gonna he gonna he gonna. This the last whooping. Cause this is Jacob's trouble coming. This gonna be the last whooping. Look what it says right here. Alright, this is what he's doing right now. 
Alright. <clears throat> Alright, this is gonna have this is the last whooping and it's gonna hurt. It's this this, this last whooping gonna hurt. Because we we are we are men, we still men, we still have emotions. We, whatever we lose, we're gonna we're gonna it, it's gonna hurt us. Yes, it's going. This is not gonna be easy. The Lord's gonna preserve who's gonna preserve, and he, that's that's it. Okay, Zechariah chapter thirteen verse eight, and it should come to pass that in all the land, say the Lord, Yahweh Shah, two parts therein shall be cut off and die, but the third should be left. Darren, I will bring. He see, he's gonna, he gonna, he gonna, he gonna hurt it. He gonna really put the last hurting on us, and it's gonna be emotional. And you know why it's gonna be emotional? Because we gonna, if we get on those, if I brought this out. We on those men. We get on those ships. What's gonna happen? We're gonna cry. We're gonna break down. We're gonna drop to the floor and cry and have and ask for the way and say the Wadi Abashim Al Shaf have mercy. Kasajim, Kasajim. All right. And I will bring them. And I will bring the third part through the fire. And I will refine them as silver is refined. And I will retry them as gold is tried. And they should call on my name. And that's what's happening right now. That third part. That um <clears throat> Yeah, that third part is calling the Abba Shemel Shah's name. But the two thirds, the two parts there is not. And I will try them as gold is tried. And they should call on my name. And I will hear them. And I will say, it is my people. And they should say, the Lord, Yahweh Shemel Shah, is my power. So, there we go, baby. This is a sure thing. This is what's happening. We can't break down now. Look, look what's happening. Look what's happening. You know, that was a quick one. Oh, let me see. I guess it wasn't that quick. I'd like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yahweh Shemel Shah, by Hashem, Kwakwadash, the Wadi Yahweh Shemel Shah, for giving us the passage and the others of great millstone, who deserved double honors rightfully so. Shalom to the Akiah. Shalom.